All right, this week's episode of The Ultimate Fighter pitted the 7-3 and three Clint Hester from Team Jones, their number one pick, against Jimmy Quinlan from Team Sonnen with a professional record of 3-0, and o, who works part-time as a cop and part-time as a fighter. And apparently that was more than enough to deal with the number one pick because he was able to get takedowns in the first round. Hester was doing better on the feet when he could keep it there, which wasn't often. And in the second round, when Quinlan got him to the ground again, he was able to jump to a full mount, take his back, ground and pound him from behind, then transition to the rear naked choke, and that was a wrap. Hester tapped out, Quinlan wins the fight, Team Sonnen regains control. Naturally, that has to be the only two guys left who haven't fought yet, which gives us Dylan Andrews versus Zachary Cummings. We'll see that fight next week. I'm Stevie J from AngryMarks.com.